Hello friends and welcome back to another Pokemon guide here on the channel. My name is Lee, also known as Osiris. And in today's guide, I'm going to show you how to get a bunch of special items, all unique to a bunch of legendaries now available in the Crown Tundra. So by now, I hope you guys are all enjoying the Crown Tundra, but we've got some more information for you in today's guide. And that is to show you where you can pick up some very unique and rare items that are signature items for some of the legendary Pokemon now in the Crown Tundra. One of these items is a very important item, especially for the Genie Trio, which is Thunderous Landers and Tornadus. And that is the Reveal Glass. The Reveal Glass allows you to change Tornadus, Thunderous and Landers into their Ethereum forms and revert them back into their incarnate forms. Now there are some prerequisites before you can actually obtain these items but we'll go through those in a minute. We need to first identify where we need to head to in the Galar region and we are going back to the main Galar region to pick up these items and you want to be heading up to store on side now there is a what trade well a what trader he's not a what trader he is just a regular market trader in the store on side to that town that will provide you with these items he is normally known for providing you with rarer items on a daily basis so you can come to him every single day and he would give you a different evolution item or something along those lines that you'd be able to purchase of them that are more rare and not obtainable so freely in the open world so if you're at the the pokemon center here in stone side you want to just take a left and it is this gentleman here and you just say i dug up some mysterious items but i've got no clue how they work maybe you could find some use for them kid why don't you take them so you turn the reveal glass is the first one that's the one we need for thunderous tornadoes and landerous to turn them into their theorem forms and revert them back into their incarnate forms so we'll put that in the bag which is great now to obtain these items you're going to have to have caught the, the relevant legendaries or the relevant legendary trios in the game so as you can see i have already traded over a bunch of pokemon that i had from my old cards them so you know i've got oh well not all of them but the majority of them so we'll see what this gentleman gives us i dug up some mysterious items but i've got no clue how they work maybe you could find some use for them kid why not take them so the DNA splicer, which is brilliant. So that is going to help us with Curum and turning him into Curum Black and Curum White. And that will be because we've got Zekrom, Reshiram and Curum in our boxes. So we've got those in our game. Come back again soon. I dug up some mystery items, but I've got no clue how they work. Maybe you could find some use for them, kid. Why don't you take them? So we'll do that again. The Adamant Orb. So that is going to be for Dialga, I believe. I believe it's for Dialga. It is for Dialga, yes. I do remember. Okay. Uh, if you just keep talking to him, he will just constantly give you the items you need. We'll get the Illustrious Orb, which is Palkia's item. And then we are going to get another item, which should be for Giratina now. I'm not sure how many items this, this trader actually gives you, but this is the Girius Orb, which is for Giratina. Um, but we're going to get more. We're going to get more. A Zygod Cube, because we do have Zygod. And that is the Zygod. Zygod cores and cells are gathered. So that's going to allow us to transform Zygod. And that is it. So I will continue to catch legends and catch the Ultra Beasts and the Tapus and things like that. And make sure I've got them in my game. And then we will be able to see if there's any more items. So I will update you on this if we do get any more but just for reference sake for this guide to show you the importance of the reveal glass which i think is probably the most important item out of the bunch that we're showing you today to obtain i'll show you how it works so you want to come to your bag you want to come to your key items reveal glasses here you can obviously see that the landerous the thunderous and the tornadoes are all in their in card forms at the moment so you can see there we go and what we want to do with the reveal glass is turn them all into their Therian forms. And you can do this just by coming to your, uh, like I say, your key items of the reveal glass. And it will just change them just like that, which is brilliant. So Lana is transformed. And then you can just use it again on Thunderous and do the game, the, the same again on the Tornadus as well. So each time and you can do the same with Zygarde and obviously with Curum, Reshiram and Curum and Zekrom. So you don't actually need all of the Pokemon in your parties. You only are gonna need one of the Pokemon of these trios to obtain these items and use them. Obviously for the Zygarde cube, 
you're going to need Zygarde in your game to obtain the Zygarde cube. But the other ones are Reveal Glass, you're going to need one of the genies for the DNA splicer. You're going to need Curum and Zekrom or Curum and Reshiram um, and so on and so on. So if you get these Pokemon, do come to this, this trader and check out the items you can get. You can get the signature items for Dialga and Palkia and obviously the Gyrios Orb for Giratina, which turns it into its kind of Gyrios form, which is the one where it's levitating rather than on the ground um with the pressure ability so that wraps up today's episode i hope you found it useful uh, these are items i feel are very important for especially series 7 coming up like i mentioned earlier on and uh, having the ability to change the Therian forms and incarnate forms is going to be very handy for you also i do hope you have found it useful if you have of course drop a like on the video do hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel and you want to see more of this sort of content and other pokemon content on the channel and leave your comments down below let me know what your thoughts are on the reveal glass and which is your favorite are you uh, an incarnate fan or are you a Therian fan i gotta say i do love the incarnates but i think thunderous Therian is probably one of my favorites and it's it's done me well it's got me second at a regional and it's got me third at a national before so i would have to go with thunderous Therian for this one let me know what yours are down below but take care of yourselves have a great one and i'll see you all for the next one so until then take care and bye bye